Fears had been raised that the Large Hadron Collider could open up a blast hole after it was announced the particle smashing device is getting a power boost. Scientists at the European Organization for Nuclear Research, CERN, are planning to revamp the LHC with more power next week as they look to unravel more mysteries of the universe. The large machine in Geneva will once again be used to smash particles into each other after the organization had some success back in December when they possibly discovered a new particle. This time around, CERN hopes that more power in the LHC will lead to greater discoveries. It wrote on a recent blog post, in 2016 the LHC will continue to open the path for new discoveries by providing up to 1 billion collisions per second to its experiments as it continues run to. The goal this year is to reach an integrated luminosity of around 25 FB1, up from the 4 FB1 it reached by the end of last year. However, more power in the machine has left some fearing the worst, with theories of black holes opening up, while others believe it could open a portal to another, more sinister, dimension. One user wrote on Twitter, the Large Hadron Collider is actually being used to open portals to the underworld to summon the ancient gods. Do the math people. Another wrote, could the Large Hadron Collider make an Earth-killing black hole? Even Pope Francis previously got in on the act, telling the masses at St. Peter's Square in May 2015, my fellow Christians, we are living in desperate times. Science is about to test the limits of God and His creation. God has created boundaries between the world of the living and the world of the dead. Are these scientists about to unleash upon us the gates of hell? Are these the days of darkness spoken of in the Bible? Are the hordes of demons lurking in the fiery pits of hell about to be thrust upon the world? These are questions we must ponder before allowing scientists to proceed to such experiments. Nonetheless, CERN has moved to ease people's fears, with its spokesman Arnold Marsolier saying that conspiracy theorists and followers of religion would probably be disappointed with the impact the experiment will have on humanity.